There's a reporting of spike in syphilis cases in Onslow County. News Channel 12's Lucy Nelson joined us now live with more on this story. And Lucy, just how much of a spike are we talking about? Frank, we're seeing a 38% increase from 2019 to 2020. Communicable Disease Nursing Supervisor Kimberly Collins broke down this data and says the county also jumped to 27th in the state. That's a pretty significant increase. Communicable Disease Nursing Supervisor Kimberly Collins says the spike in syphilis cases is turning heads at the Onslow County Health Department. Why Onslow? Collins says she's not sure, but over 50% of the new early diagnosis syphilis cases in the state were in people ages 20 to 34, which she says could in part have something to do with Jacksonville being the youngest city in the United States demographically. Syphilis can go on and stay in your body for a long time, cause organ damage. It can lead to neurosyphilis, which affects your nervous system, brain. It can affect your eyes and even result in death long term if you never are treated for it. She says the good news is many of these effects can be prevented with protection and regular screenings. You cannot have symptoms and spread them to your partners unknowingly or not be treated. So getting a screening and making sure that you are detected early and receive that treatment is crucial to kind of stopping the flow of it. Chlamydia and gonorrhea cases are down, but some think with COVID, those numbers appear lower because people aren't seeking treatment. Reporting live from Monsell County, I'm Lucy Nelson with News Channel 12.